Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about factoring quadratic expressions. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, 28n to the 4th plus 16n to the 3rd minus 80n squared, and we need to factor this completely. Well, first thing I notice, 4 goes into 28, 16, and 80. And all parts actually have an n squared as well. So I'm going to pull that out, and I pull out a 4n squared from all parts, and we're left with a 7n squared plus 4n minus 20. All right. So for right now, I'm going to ignore this 4n squared and deal with the other parts. So let's go rewrite this down here. And we know it has to be in some factored form. Well, our a value inside the parentheses from here on out is 7, a prime number. So we know it has some form of 7n, and then this one is just an n here. So now I have to look at the negative 20. Then I'm going to write a positive 20 and write the list of the two numbers that multiply to be 20. 1 and 20, 2 and 10, and 4 and 5. Now, since it's a negative 20, one of these numbers will have to be negative. Let's keep that in mind. Don't forget it. So now we have to ask ourselves a question. 7 times which one of these numbers, and it could be positive or negative, plus its other pair, positive or negative, equals positive 4, that b value. Okay? And, well, the pair that I'm looking at here is the 2 and the 10. 7, and it's going to be well, the negative 10. 7 times a positive 2 is 14. 14 plus the negative 10 equals a positive 4. And a lot of times it takes some trial and practice to get this down. So 2 and negative 10 are our two numbers. So let's make sure now 7n we said was going to be multiplied by the positive 2. So we put a plus 2 on this side. And then we have a minus 10 here. It goes there. And so now we have it actually in completely factored form. 4n squared times 7n minus 10 times n plus 2. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.